Miss Leanne here on Grady's Mom. I wanted to show you what I stock in my bathroom. I actually did a full bathroom tour video a couple months back, so I will link that below um, in case you want to see where I store everything in my bathroom. Uh, but my husband recently redid this closet, and the only thing that's left to be done are these wooden shelves have to be painted white. Uh, originally, this closet was just a, a disaster because there was this shelf here on the top, the white one, and then these two shelves here were not even here. And then there was a shelf right here, but there was a whole bunch of wasted space. And my husband just kind of reconfigured the spacing and gave me more shelves, more storage. There's actually so much storage, I haven't even filled it up yet. But I did want to show you because this is a time of year in the fall when I stock up my home uh, because we have really bad winters here in New York and I like to make sure I have everything I need. Fall is always that time of year where I like to stock up my cabinets and freezers and all of our kind of toiletry items. So I wanted to do an updated video, um, again, to show you what I have in here. So I'm going to run through quickly what I have and uh, kind of give you an overview of it all. I keep toilet paper, tissues up here. I have the smaller boxes of tissues, and then I have the larger boxes of tissues. And then again, I always keep toilet paper in the corner. On the second shelf down in this corner, I always keep all of our travel cosmetic bags. Um, this bin is full of all different makeup bags and toiletry bags to take on the road on the go and then I've got this little caddy here that has all different like ointments and lotions some scissors I have like a bunch of the O'Keeffe's so I have like lip repair and skin repair hand repair this is a really good uh, brand if you have like a construction worker or a tradesman that always has like really rough hands and feet so I keep all that stuff in here and again like a bunch of different lotions um, and different things like that and then I have our first aid bins here I've got in this bottom bin all of our first aid things like Excedrin and cough drops thermometers bandages and then I actually recently started a second bin um, for kids stuff so I have like my son's Benadryl I've got some cough medicine and cough syrup actually that's not even in there yet but this is gonna be Grady's bin this is like the everyday first aid um, aspirin Tums anything like that that's related to medicine and then next to that I always keep bug spray and sunscreen and then I've got two bigger bottles here of NyQuil and DayQuil and I the reason I don't keep them in the bins is because they'd have to lie down um, because they're too tall for the bins and I don't want them to spill all over I've got Dixie cups that I keep in here I've got all of our lint rollers here because we have a cat so I have lint rollers and then the current one that I'm using I've got q-tips here and then moving down to the second shelf this is my bin that I keep my empties in like my empty products I literally just filmed a video so it is currently empty usually it would be full and then this is where I keep all of my like sample size items or no not sample travel size items so like trial size items in these two bins here so I've got all different things body washes and lotions and all different travel size items in here I've got my body washes here so I've got a few Dove products my husband's body washes I just stocked these up um, I had a really good coupons at CVS so I got him like Axe and Irish Spring and then this one's left over I think from I think the Bath and Body Works sale from Bath and Body Works this is all hair care so I've got like dry shampoo and conditioners different hair masks and then in back of this um, there's a bunch of different shampoos in here um, so I like to keep everything pretty stocked up as you can see I've got all my son's honest company stuff so I've got bubble bath and body wash and lotion I've got a big bottle of mouthwash here as a backup I've got my shave gel and deodorant and then behind that I keep my husband's shave gel and deodorant so I try to sort of categorize things the best that I can um, that just makes sense for me and then the next shelf down I've got hand soaps we go through these pretty quickly uh, we have three sinks um, in our home so we go through hand soaps pretty quickly I've got a couple random things here I've got some makeup brush cleaner and some nail polish remover and this is like a facial spray here I've got like some higher end non-drugstore things a lot of masks so I have my glam glow mask I've got some Origins masks here, and then behind that is an Origins um, exfoliating face scrub. 
and then the next row is um, the next couple rows is drugstore things so I have my backup St. Ives coconut oil scrub and I have some Trader Joe's cleansing oil and it's some um, toner behind that I stocked up on these deep action exfoliating clean and clear scrubs um, I got them at CVS when I have like 30% off coupons and then moving along I have different lotions so this is the coconut melt lotion by Kapari that I use on my son's eczema and dry patches it really works um, this I find has worked the best for him even over like prescription uh, lotions and things and then I've got my backup Clinique face moisturizer and a couple backup body scrubs by Tree Hut and then Bobbi Brown I stocked up on a couple of my eye makeup removers from CVS um, so I've got a couple there. I've got a backup lotion. I'm really loving that Nivea one. I keep my son's backup vitamins in here. So I've got his multivitamin and then his probiotic vitamin. And then in that bin in the back, I keep all extra razors and blades for my, for my husband and I. In this bin, I have a bunch of different wipes. So I've got wet wipes, makeup wipes, boogie wipes, anything wipe related. Got some individual wipes here and then a backup of my cotton rounds that I use for my toner or eye makeup remover. And then I have this whole new shelf here that I haven't even been able, been able to fill up yet, but I'm sure I will. So I've got a makeup mirror in here and then a few pieces of decor that were in here. Uh, but currently I have this stuff out and then I keep my everyday products in here. Again, I'll link that bathroom video down below. I also have this storage and then on the bottom I keep bathroom towels, hand towels, extra like feminine products and then in this bin in the corner I keep all of our like hot tools. So I've got like my husband's clippers and my hair straightener, a hair dryer, a curling wand, a curling iron. It's all kind of kept in that basket. I really like to keep everything organized so I can easily grab what I need and find what I need uh, without searching all around everywhere. Um, so this stuff in here is all again like backup things. Um, my regular used things are pretty much in here and then also on my um, bathroom vanity and then of course I have the storage um, in here as well. So that is pretty much the closet right now and since I just stocked it up I wanted to share it with you. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Have a great day and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.